Wow, look at that. This is the old right-of-way for the old train at, at the uh, Fort Wilderness campground at Disney World. And the train, they had a steam engine that ran down through here. And these were the cross ties. You can still see the, some of the cross ties. Of course, now this tree, this tree has just grown up over the track. You can't even see the tracks anymore. Of course, they pulled the tracks up. But the train ran right along this. You see this hump that they built up. They hauled in tons and tons and tons of gravel. Somebody else, some deer or something, been walking around through here. Look at this. Look. It's almost impassable now. See that? It just goes and... Now you... Ooh, sorry. Now you can't even get through it anymore. The tree has fallen. You could probably get around it, but... Isn't that wild? This was the train. You can still see the... See the uh, right-of-way. Went all around, all the way to the front, with some of the cross ties. Kind of gotten moldy. You see where they, the pea gravel, the, the gravel, it looks like a form of granite or something. I heard that this gravel was too loose of a ballast. <laughs> if you look at it, it's, yeah, that looks like granite. That sure does look, that looks like, looks like a form of granite ballast. And that, I don't think it held the, held the ties in right. Yeah, I hear the train. Jay, you can sure see the, see the tracks. Yeah, the ghost train. It was some kind of ride, though. It was some kind of ride. You can see the, see how it runs around there. This is, uh. What is it? Middle of February uh, 2014. And uh, <laughs> it wasn't this one. Yeah, look at that granite ballast. You could still hear it. There's a piece of, piece of the. Uh, it's an interesting looking bug or whatever it is. Yeah, these are, these are cross ties. You know, what's really interesting, some people don't know this, but the train went right through here. And, uh, you can follow the track. Let me get to where, show you where this comes out at. A lot of people come over here and never even realize. You can see from up here how the, how it's sort of lifted up. Of course, the trees have grown really overgrown now. That sound you hear in the background are the buses stopping. This actually comes out right at the bus stop. It's been a lot of years since this train ever ran. It didn't run long. And if you notice it comes out right here. You can still, still sort of see the cross ties in place comes around it comes out right here at the settlement area at the Pioneer Hall of course the last cross ties right about here that you can still make out we found some we went hunting for them and found them look at that one right there in plain sight is a cross tie and right here's the settlement bus depot right here you can see the Cross ties still kind of running through, kind of running through here, right where this golf cart parking area was. And the ballast is built up. You can still see the granite ballast. It's a beautiful ballast, but it didn't lock the ties in. The track kind of went through there, went around. And here's the uh, outpost area. A little bit of Fort Wilderness history for you there. The uh, Fort Wilderness train. That's my son Skyler. He loves trains. I wish I could take him on that ride.